been uh, doing the 180 degrees program here at Silver Creek for two years now. And um, we get students that otherwise would be ignored or uh, just written off as failures from the get-go. And not because that they are egregious behavior problems or that they uh, don't test very well, they're usually very bright students, but they're just so under-motivated. They come to school, uh, they don't do their work, and we're trying to figure out what could motivate them. And this is one of the best programs I've seen in 23 years as far as doing that with these students. I've gotten a lot of satisfaction working with my colleagues who know that I'm interested in this population and watching the youngsters bloom and begin to trust again, to open up and realize that there is more to life and their own success than their typical performance, that they can change their ways of thinking and um, approaching whatever they're doing in life. The 180 Degrees program has helped um, demystify the connection between teachers and students. We have a lot more time in the block to get to know each other. They feel like a family with themselves. They watch out for each other. They understand that this is about succeeding and they will encourage the, each other and tell me also about it. It's a very rewarding situation for me to see young people on a personal basis and get to know them in a way that uh, goes beyond just the usual classroom. Social emotional learning, social emotional learning, is something that we've looked at for many years. We call it the affective sort of approach to teaching and to me that's the only way you really can really reach a person. If they love you, if they know you love them, they're going to be a lot more responsive to their own learning. And they do. I've had them in here say many times, Miss Mason, you know, we wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for you caring about us. And um, just trying to reach somebody intellectually or academically is like trying to understand somebody without being able to see or hear them at all. You just really are limiting yourself in a real way. I just, I just hope the district uh, and other districts and other communities can recognize the value of 180 degrees and uh, not cut it out with the economy causing funding issues. We really need to keep this program for our students.